know you guys. You do? I know you, but other people don't know, so who are you? I'm Barry Gordon, also known as Donatello. Fantastic. And you, sir? I'm Townsend Coleman, also known as Michelangelo, dudes. Fuck on. No, I'm, I'm Townsend Coleman. No. You are? Oh, no. okay, then I... You're the leader. Oh, I'm the leader. That makes me Cam Clark. Leonardo. Fantastic. Right. And I'm cleaning my oven. And I'm Raphael of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I'm Rob Paulson. That's awesome. So before you were speaking about one of the, the lesser known benefits of being a turtle, could you tell me a little bit about what you said on stage before? Yeah, just about as, as the show has grown, we've gotten to find out um, how much it's meant to people when they were growing up and uh, the lessons that they would take away from uh, many of the stories in the Ninja Turtles. And, yeah. Gosh, and, and what it meant to them, and we had no idea when we were recording the show. It's just uh, been amazing to see and humbling. To it's see. an incredible honor to be able to uh, not only uh, work on something that becomes a, 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 achieves iconic status, uh, but all of us have had the, the the really good fortune of sp spending time with families and children, whether it's in person or on the phone. Uh, in some pretty diabolical circumstances in which they open their hearts up to you and they uh, sort of allow you in um, to, to share what can be a very difficult circumstance. And the turtles, through us, yes. end up making you know those kids smile and the parents often more than the kids. And then we take way more out of it than the kids do. It's, it's a real privilege to be in that position. There was an organization years ago called Famous Phone Friends. Yeah. And uh, all of us, from the Ninja Turtles to Snow White, Bart Simpson, and Goofy. Yeah, and it's not just us. <laughs> we, yeah. This uh, law firm donated Bear their Stearns. It was uh, Bear's, the investment firm. Their, their yeah. whole floor, and we would all go down at Christmas time, and we'd talk to two hospitalized, you know, sick and or terminal. All of the know, country. Kids, all over North all America. Country. Yeah. And, I remember one, for example, and it's so moving where, you know, I'm talking to this, I put this little girl on and I don't hear anything in response. And the mom gets on and she says, she can't, she can't talk, but if you could see her face yeah. right now, she is, she is beaming. Right. Um, it was Tears a great, up. great and organization. Yeah, it's something that, that has nothing to do with ratings or money or action figures. All of which certainly is important to keep everybody employed, but when you have that kind of connection and you're involved with it, it's, uh, it's really, really beyond. And, 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 she, and, and the first fan, the first big turtle fan that I ever met and, and had a, a, a kind of a general, you know, pen pal relationship with was Ryan, Ryan, Ryan Jean, who um, is, is uh, I think the expression that I would use for Ryan is handy, extremely capable. Oh, handy yeah. capable. Um, I yeah. mean, he's an amazing guy. Really? He's yeah. done great things in his life and and told me that and told all of us that, you know, Turtles was such an important motivator yeah. for him, you know, because he did have, he has a cerebral palsy, and but, but he is just the most wonderfully effective human being I think I've ever met and he's been involved with uh, with an organization called Camp Willoway for a while and and, um, and he's, he's just a so that told me something that, that turtles had had an impact beyond just kind of making people happy for a half hour and that was really a shock and I don't think any of us had any sense when we first started this um, that it was going to have this kind of impact on people like that Certainly, I was just thinking this is just another job. It's a, you know, I'm very fortunate to have this job. Right. And uh, but it's a cartoon. Um, How could you? Started, yeah. When we started getting, you know, the letters early on, and then certainly all these years later, now, you know, to meet these kids who have grown up into adults, and we, you know, we meet them and they tell us these stories. It is, it is just yeah. mind-bending and I mean, truly, truly humbling. That's awesome. Well, I know my boyfriend is jealous right now that I'm here. So. <laughs> <laughs> Just want to thank you guys so much for thank talking you, and thank keep you. doing keep doing great work and keep changing people's lives. You too. <laughs> turtle power. Yeah. Could I get one big turtle power for oh, you guys? Sure. Okay. Here we go. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Turtle power. All right.
Dudes.